Hey guys, I'm Cody, the editor behind Past Life Pro, and for this tutorial, I thought I'd teach you how to install shaders through the use of Optifine for Minecraft version 1.9.2. So, my friends, let's get to it. Before we start things off, here's what you'll need. First, you'll need specifically Optifine 1.9.2 HD UV2. Second, you will need a shaders pack that's compatible with this version. I will be using the latest Continuum V1.2, non-PBR. PBR meaning pixel-based reflections. As to why I'm not using a version that holds this feature, it's mainly due to how poorly the shader is optimized. In my opinion, stick with this variant until things are more performance friendly. And yeah, to download this, I provided a link in the shaders and resource pack section of the description of this video. Alright, first step, open up Minecraft. And click new profile. For the profile name, it doesn't matter what you name it, but in my case, I'm gonna go with 1.9.2 shaders, no forge. When you've done that, move to use version. Scroll up and find release 1.9.2 and click it. As an optional step, depending on your system's amount of RAM, you can allocate it to Minecraft. To do this, simply uncheck the box that reads JVM Arguments and locate this number 1. The 1 means a single gigabyte of RAM is currently allocated. I've been told that 2 to 4 gigabytes of RAM is your best bet, so since I rock a stellar 32 gigabytes of RAM, allocating 4 will be my choice. Of course, if you only have 4 gigs of RAM, then I'd recommend going with 2 or 3. Click Save Profile, find your profile, then click Play. When Minecraft loads up, quit the game. Now, let's install our Optifine Shaders mod combination. Double click the Shaders file. Click Install. Alright, now that that's done, let's move back to Minecraft. Locate your profile, mine's 1.9.2 shaders, no forge, and click edit profile. For this part, the only thing we're going to change is the version. So locate this 1.9.2 Optifine version with the U underscore B2 on the end. This is the one we need, so click it and save profile. Make sure your profile is selected, then click play. Now that Minecraft is loaded up, our final step will be to add in our shaders pack. To do this, follow my lead. Click the options tab, video settings, shaders, and then shaders folder. Here's where you'd add in your shaders pack. Make sure your shader is selected, then click done. When you check this out in Minecraft, things should be good to go. You have shaders working perfectly for Minecraft 1.9.2. So, my job here is complete. If this tutorial was been used to you, then do it the like button. And before you go, don't forget to check out my channel for some more Minecraft tutorials, some pro quality cinematics, and a bunch of other videos that you shouldn't miss. Anyways, I'm Cody, and this is Past Life Pro, where creativity is always a part of my life as it will be for yours. Alright, see you guys!